I did something very courageous recently. I took the bull by its nuts and rode that baby all through town. Also known as I started the One Piece adventure. I started watching One Piece. The show that was created at the beginning of time. When God created the heavens and the earth, he also created One Piece. The cavemen grew up watching One Piece. And I'm sure your grandparents even grew up watching the show. And they're probably going to die before they ever get to see the ending. But please stop the worship. I'm no religious figure for embarking on this treacherous journey all alone. I'm more than that. I'm a YouTuber. And more specifically today, I'm an anime YouTuber. I just wanted to make this video as one of those hello to me 10 years in the future. I know One Piece is still airing, so here's some words of encouragement to keep you pushing to watch each and every new episode. Just do it. It's not worth it. Don't ruin your life over some octopus girl that can spawn arms because of your wild anime fantasies. It's, just quit the show, please. But yeah, I'm about 175 episodes in as of recording this video, so I'm still suckling from the One Piece tit for sustenance. I'm, I haven't grew my sea legs yet and took my first steps. I'm just simply a One Piece newborn. But I do really enjoy the show right now, and I won't be speaking about any spoilers, even though I've barely scratched the surface when it comes to One Piece. I'm just going to be talking about what I like and what I dislike so far, and basically One Piece overall. Then I'll be wrapping it up real nice and tight, setting it under the Christmas tree, and then that'll be the end of the video. The thing I like most about One Piece, though, is definitely the characters. The uniqueness and attention they put into every aspect of each character. Not even just the main characters, most of the side characters and villains as well. It just makes you feel the amount of effort they put into them, and it just it creates this, this feeling that most other animes don't really create with me. And even though this is one of the older animes, I don't feel like anyone's came close to the uniqueness that One Piece brings to the table. The power system is very unique. The characters are unique. The story is unique. The setting is unique. Everything about it is just uniqueness to its core. The only small complaint I have so far is that the beginning of the show was kind of slow. Like, I didn't really get what was going on at first. I don't know if it's just me being a dunderhead or if it was just the show being slow to try to get everything set up, but... I guess it's kind of expected from a new show, especially back then. They didn't really have anything to build off of like new anime does. They can build off all these old ones, but it still works out good. It's like it's picking up faster and it's way better now, but the beginning was kind of slow. It's not unbearable, but I did stop and then pick it back up, but it was worth it. It's definitely worth it to push through. I don't know if it felt like that for anyone else, but the beginning felt kind of slow is the only bad thing I have to say so far. I just want to say that Eichiro Oda... You're, you're an absolute mastermind, an absolute genius. You have somehow made this anime so freakishly long, and apparently it's still beloved. It's still amazing throughout all those episodes, and I've seen things saying like it's not estimated to be done, the manga, until like 2024, 2025, which means the anime will probably be going on for many years to come. But I think they said something about like 2016, the guy said it was 65% done. And the estimated, like I said, was about four or five years from now. So we'll see where it leads us. So far, so good. I could definitely see how they keep it going for 900 and some episodes now. It's it's good. It's just a fun time to watch. It's enjoyable. It's not something you have to think too hard about. It's just something you can kind of watch and you, you resonate with the characters. And you, you automatically automatically pick out that Zoro's the best. Because come on now, he's just such a he's just such a bad A, man. He's so hot. But yeah, there's really a character for everybody to love in One Piece. They're all they're all great. Everything about it so far is so good. I, I can definitely see myself finishing this. Maybe may it may take a while, but uh I'll get there. I'll definitely get there. It's been running since July 22nd, 1997, so about 24 years, and it, they're going strong. It's 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 very good. But yeah, that's really all I gotta say. I just wanted to talk about One Piece for a bit, get to the, get the weeb side to come out of me, so maybe I could lose some subscribers and some views. But that's all for me. I'll see you next time. Peace out. It takes a lot of courage, effort, and an absurdly high sperm count to actually sit down and catch up on One Piece. Just to even start the journey down the One Piece trail.